Ooh, check this out. Got a BMW i8 Roadster. Whatever happened to these? I feel like they don't make them anymore. This thing's gorgeous in the burnt orange. Look at that. Or copper, I don't know, whatever you wanna call it. <laughs> it's still cool. Oh, it's electric, so maybe it's a copper top. I'm getting it. <laughs> All right, I'm over here at Target and Evans, and uh, so some of you noticed that I repeated a video, uh, not yesterday, but two days ago, because I didn't realize it until I started reading the comments. Well, I was here and there were some new cars and it looked uh, very similar to another video and I ended up deleting the wrong one. So, my bad, you got to watch some old footage. I apologize for that. <laughs> uh, this looks like some sort of K case was there, not K, yeah, K, K was there, if I remember correctly what I was talking about, but I was really kind of emphasizing that they had gotten this that was pretty much what the whole video was about. They have the AMG Mercedes 300 SEL AMG. And right behind it was the, what is it, the Mustang. Yeah, the Mustang with the removable hood. This thing is pretty cool. Uh, the Porsche is right above it. I'm surprised it's still here, but there's the Porsche. And then the Camaro Z06. So it was like eight, nine, no, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And I was like, oh, this is so cool. That was pretty much the whole video, but <laughs> I don't know how it happened, but I ended up deleting the wrong one. You would think, hey, silly, uh, they were like three days apart. How did you do that? I just saw the Target video and I deleted it and then uploaded the wrong one. Uh, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe because I do this stuff late at night after work. Anyway, uh, so sorry about that, but now you're all caught up. <laughs> Take a look at these. Got some Target exclusives in there, that's cool. And yeah, this is actually really cool. I like this one a lot. I wonder what the regular treasure hunt is supposed to be in here. Uh, I don't know, we'll find out. We'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Time will bring us to everything. Let's see. Leftovers here on the pegs. No, I think that's it. So now we're all caught up. Let me put all this stuff away that I made a mess with. And uh, yeah, we'll be moving on. All right, we're over here at Walmart in Grovetown. We're checking the pegs. They got a bunch of Hot Wheels boxes right there, but I saw that guy right there, then that made me super curious about what I would find right here. And it looks like we got more of these Zamek cars, which is awesome. I'm so excited. I love the Zameks. So we're gonna go ahead and peek through the pegs here. Here we go. We got another Audi Zamek. We'll just put that right there. And I think we're not gonna get any, maybe one more set, just one more, but not too many more of the Audis, right? I think we're doing okay. But let's see if we can find ourselves a Bone Shaker and a Mazda, what's that thing called? Mazda 787B, there we go. There is the Collector Zamek, that is the Best one in my book. I love this thing. So there is another one. We'll just put, the, oh, there's two more. Oh, this case had a lot more. If you remember the last case we saw, it only had like two of the Audis and it had two of the collector. This one's got a lot more in it. That's already two collectors and one, two, three, four of the Audis. So that's, and here's another collector. So yeah, yeah, that's huge. That is a lot more. Okay. Uh, those don't look like the right car. I'm dropping cars. Of course I am. That's how I roll. There is one of the 787Bs. It's a mainline, darn it. <laughs> All right. All right, I'm making a mess now. I think we're good. We're not good. We are good. Look at it. We're good now. <laughs> oh, look at that. We got the Mazda 787B Super Treasure Hunt. 
Oh, it's beautiful and it comes with the Zamex. Yes, that is something. Look at that, where's the main line? There we go, we can do a little comparison. That is nice. Oh, wow. Oh, Dominic, this is his favorite car. And he wanted to be with me because he wanted to find it first. He just had his birthday. You know what I have to do, right? This is his, this is Dominic Super. Well, happy birthday, Dominic. <laughs> you got one. Very cool. All right, lucky him. I'll bring that home for him. I'll bring home the main line too so he can open one and play with it. It's a little beat up anyway, so why not? Uh, man, that's nice. That was great. Uh, we'll leave these, why not? And why don't we just end it with a little uh, thumbnail photo right there. There we go. Oh, that's beautiful, right? That is gorgeous. Very nice, very nice. We're definitely grabbing that and I might as well just get one more. One more of each, why not? It's such a good night. And there's the other Zamek too, but the actual Zamek. Oh, we'll grab that for him too awesome awesome that was great let me pick up that car i dropped what a good day <laughs> there you go uh anything else going on here oh man uh moving parts they haven't moved at all i mean we saw these the other night and oof, golly nothing going on there okay no biggie no biggie anything else nothing nothing at all man Okay, cool. I think we did great. Some Xamex and uh, a Super Trash on. <laughs> Sweet. We are moving on. Love it. All right, so I'm over here at Publix and I'm checking the pegs real quick because another collector told me I should be looking for this Audi right here. So this is the k or j or k case uh audi and it does not have a fuel door on the back but some of them do so this is an international card so you don't have the uh code that indicates what case this is from or the you know stamp guarantee there on the hook so uh, here's another one so there's two of them here right so there's no gas door on here but i'm going to show you a quick clip of one that does have the gas door all right with the gas doors and there you go so they have two different castings of this one car for this year with the gas door and without the gas door. Does, is the gas door on the other side? Could I tell? Do they do it like European style? Like these are the international ones, so they don't have a gas car or gas door on this side, it's on the other side. Ooh, I can't tell. I can't tell. I don't think there is one, but I can't tell. So let's just dig through these real quick. This is a different color interesting and it has the gas door there while this one doesn't oh man so that's something else so this looks like it could be uh l case they might have some l case here they might because look at this they've got the uh the jaguar type f project 7 here in this maroon color yeah, they've got some L case cars here. Uh, I don't know if this is a dud or not because I don't know what case it is. Could be a dud, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, it depends if this was a K or a J case, but yeah, look at that. So we've got some cars here from the L case. It was my first sighting of L case cars. I'm very excited, but not the uh, Firebird. <laughs> I wanna see that Firebird. All right, anyway, so yeah, cool. Fuel doors, no fuel doors, interesting. Look at that. All right, we're moving on. <laughs>